Good day, everyone, and welcome to Learn English with Blaine. And so this is your advanced dictation with the focus on nouns for Friday, April, produced on Friday, April the 8th. Okay, so let's get started. So just a few instructions in case you are new to the channel. So I'm going to say the passage once at a normal rate. I will repeat each passage two more times, but much slower. And the goal here is to simply write as much as you can. And then I will show you the passage at the end. So you, after I say it, you will see what I said. Don't worry if you make a few uh, spelling mistakes or if you miss a few words. That's okay. The important thing is that you practice. And remember, this is really a listening practice and with a writing practice as well. One more thing. Remember to underline the nouns after you write your dictation. So you are going to write out your dictation and then you are going to underline the nouns that you see. And again, if you don't get all the nouns, that is fine. That is okay too, of course. Remember that nouns are people, places, and things as well as ideas. And in a future video, I'll talk more about this. But just remember that nouns are people, places, and things, and ideas. Okay, remember also to have your pen and paper ready because you are going to write what I say on paper, right? And so what you are going to do is you are going to listen and then write what you hear me say. And then you can underline the nouns after. So here's an example. If I was to say, because I am new here, comma, I really don't know the city very well. For example, comma, I don't even know where the local hospital is. Okay, so you would listen to that, and then this is what I said. Because I am new here, comma, I really don't know the city very well, period. For example, comma, I don't even know where the local hospital is. Now this is just an example so you can understand how it works. And then in this slide, you would underline the nouns. For example, I, here, I, city, I once again, and then hospital. Okay, so now we are going to do our actual dictation. And again, remember, I'm going to say each one three times, and then you are going to underline the nouns that you, on your paper that you see. Okay, let's get started. Dictation one. While eating enough calories is important for everyone, comma, it is doubly important for growing children. Okay, so I'm going to say that two more times slower. While eating enough calories, while eating enough calories is important for everyone, comma, is important for everyone, comma, it is doubly important, it is doubly important for growing children, for growing children. Okay, so I'm going to give you a moment to underline those nouns, and then we'll move on to the next one. While eating enough calories is important for everyone, comma, it is doubly important for growing children. And here we see the nouns. Eating, this one is actually what we call a gerund, right? It's a, it's a noun that looks like a verb with the ing. And again, in a future video, I'll talk about these. Calories is a noun. Everyone, it's a group of people that's a noun. And then children is also a noun as well. Okay, let's move on to dictation number two.
Even though the day didn't start off too well, comma, it sure got better as it wore on, exclamation point. I received a huge bonus from my boss as well as a promotion. Even though the day, even though the day didn't start off too well, didn't start off too well, comma, it sure got better, it sure got better, as it wore on, as it wore on, exclamation point. I received a huge bonus, I received a huge bonus from my boss, from my boss, as well as, as well as a promotion, a promotion. Okay, so I'll give you a few moments to underline the nouns. Even though the day didn't start off too well, it sure got better as it wore on. I received a huge bonus from my boss as well as a promotion. And here we see that the nouns are day, I, bonus, boss, promotion. Okay, let's go on to dictation number three. I really enjoy golfing, comma, but I don't get to go often because the rest of my family hates it. I go with a few friends once a month or so. I really enjoy golfing, comma, I really enjoy golfing, comma. But I don't get to go often. But I don't get to go often. Because the rest of my family, because the rest of my family hates it. Hates it. Exclamation. I go with a few friends. I go with a few friends once a month or so. Once a month or so. Okay, so I'll let you finish that off and then check your nouns and then I'll show you what I said. Okay, I really enjoy golfing, comma, but I don't get to go often because the rest of my family hates it, exclamation mark. I go with a few friends once a month or so. So in this dictation, we can see golfing. This is again one of those gerund nouns that we see. I, family, it, friends. Okay, so that was dictation number three. So let's go on to dictation number four. Harry told me I should buy a new car, period. I went to see him last week, comma, and he said my car engine was way too loud, period. The problem is that I just bought it, comma, and I am still making payments on it. 
Okay. Harry told me. Harry told me. I should buy a new car. I should buy a new car. Period. I went to see him last week, comma. I went to see him last week, comma. And he said my car engine, and he said my car engine was way too loud. Was way too loud. Period. The problem is that I just bought it, comma. The problem is that I just bought it, comma. And I am still, and I am still making payments on it, exclamation. Making payments on it, exclamation. Okay, I'll give you a few minutes, a few seconds to to write that out and to, to finish writing it off and check your nouns. And then we'll go on to dictation five. Okay, now in this dictation, these are the nouns. Harry, <clears throat> me, I, car, I again, him, he, engine, problem, I, it, I, payments, and it. We see a lot of pronouns, right? Like I and I and he and I again and it. These are all what we call pronouns. These are words that take the place of a noun, but they're still classified as nouns. Okay, so let's move on to dictation number five. And this one says, why don't you come over? Sorry, why don't you come on over? Maybe we could watch a movie or play a game or something, period. Give me a call if you are interested, period. I will be home until 5 p.m. Okay, so let's go through it two more times. Why don't you come on over, question mark. Why don't you come on over, question mark. Maybe we could watch a movie. Maybe we could watch a movie or play a game or something or play a game or something period give me a call if you are interested give me a call if you are interested period i will be home i will be home until 5 p.m. until 5 p.m. okay very good so I'll give you a, a few seconds to finish that off and underline the nouns Okay, so here we are. Why don't you come on over? Maybe we could watch a movie or play a game or something, period. Give me a call if you are interested, I, period. I will be home until 5 p.m. And on this one, we see that the nouns are you, we, game, something, me, call, you, I and home and actually this one here movie movie is also a noun as well so you know what and you guys if when when you are doing this and if you have a question maybe you see something that you wonder if it's a noun or not leave that question or that comment in the chat box because maybe I missed one right so 
Let me know in the questions in the comments if you have any questions or comments and we could discuss those. I will definitely respond to your comments. So anyways, everyone, um, I want to thank you all very much for watching the video and watching it all the way through. I really appreciate it. I hope you did really well. <clears throat> and remember to leave your comments or questions in the comment section. I really appreciate those. And if you like the video, please remember to share, like, and subscribe. And again, leave comments. And until next time, there'll be three more videos coming next week. The next advanced video is going to be Friday and the intermediate video is going to be on Wednesday. So thank you so much everyone. Have a wonderful day. Thank you.